Right, welcome along everybody to episode 5 in my Indie Games Review series. First one up is 3D Stereo Studio HD. Now this is just something that I thought looked kind of different. Let's go. Previous model next to me, okay, it seems pretty simple. Um, I suppose it kind of looks 3D. No, it just looks like crap. No, I don't want to purchase. What else is there? 3D plane. You can zoom in and out with one joystick and you can look around the other. It doesn't look that 3D. I suppose it kind of does. But it doesn't like come at me. Whether well, you need a 3D TV for this, I just thought it was cool so I figured I'd show it. So, Right, next game. Okay, so game number two is Star St Stardust Hunter Pop Poi. I think it's called. Okay, so here we go. I cannot save apparently, but that's not really a problem. Go for game start. Wow. Oh. So this is pretty much it apparently. You just have to collect the stars. You can use the bumpers or the D-pad or the joystick. Either of them. And that pretty much seems like it. I mean, what have I got to do? I've got a score of 50, 60. Oh, it's speeding up a bit. Well, it's different I suppose. It's nothing spectacularly amazing, but you know. Seems alright. Don't know if I'd buy it, but that's the next game in the in the there's four out this week, so it's the second out of four. Right, next one. <coughs> so the third game is gonna be Ocean Drive Challenge. Have a look, this is a car game. Probably gather that from the name to be honest. But yeah, we know, skip. <coughs> this is also eight points, all the games I'm doing are eighty points. So yeah, it looked alright though, the start game. Graphics didn't look too bad. Oh, we can only be him anyway, right? Ooh. Oh wait, no. No, crap. Let's try that again. Be the dude. We'll go auto because I'm lame. And show comments. We'll have comments. Hi Jacob, I if I'm busy. Shuffle, play everything, let's go. Okay, steering seems a bit dodgy. Left triggers brake, right triggers drive. <laughs> Here I go again on my own. Yes, I do. Oh, it's not too bad. It reminds me. Oh crap! Of um, <coughs> like an old Dreamcast game or something. I remember what it's called? Like Outrun, isn't it? Oof, that was well close. So yeah, I mean, another indie game. This doesn't look too bad for 80 points, to be honest considering some of the stuff you see. Get owned. You can't seem to really crash, I don't think. I'm going to try. No, it kind of turns for you a little bit, but you have to do the rush yourself. Can we flash? Oops. That will teach me to go around push all the buttons. Catch up with this guy again. So yeah, that's the, this, 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 blah, 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 blah. That's this game out of the way. Ooh, we just crossed the line. Hey, right. We do the last one. Right, so it's the last one. Avatar Grand Prix 2. Press start. Guessing there's a one as well. Screen edges, position the flags so there as well. Oh. Ooh. About there, I suppose. Would you like to try a quick test drive before you begin a test drive? Nah, we we'll do it later. I don't need to familiarise myself. Yeah, that'll do. Now this has got online multiplayer, so... Oh well. <laughs> god knows what it will be like if you play it online. Oh god, I'm really crap at this. I get the idea it's a little bit like Mario Kart. Because you get, if I manage to crap, get a box and not die. Stop hitting the wall, you big turd. Hey, I'm first. Look at that. Even when I'm bumping off all the walls. Right, just get a box. X. Oh. Oh, you push A to use, right? So I just laid a mine. Everyone else has got stuff. Whoa. Crazy. Well, you know, for 80 points, it could be quite a laugh. So hopefully there's longer tracks than this. This is a little bit on the short side. Oh, a magnet, what does that do? If I can stop bouncing off the walls, I'll find out. 
Oh, I'm guessing if anyone's in front of me, it bollocks pulls them towards me. So yeah, that's the last game this week. Cheers for watching, guys. And hope you enjoyed it.